Commander, please don't look at me like that. Sorry, sorry. You still care about my appearance, Commander? You lost your body and became a mechanical entity, and now you take up a new identity. It, it must be hard for you to accept all this. Some accidents must have happened while my body was being rebuilt. So I didn't change back to my original form. Wait, maybe the bearer used ionis to make you this body? I don't know the technical details, but I can be sure the ionis crystals were used to process. Unbelievable. The bearer actually mastered such unheard of technology. If we took this a step further, would we be able to save some wounded soldiers with only their brains left? This would be a huge step to the uh, pursuit of immortality. So is that why Rose has been so keen in advancing research in ionis? Um, anyway. Let's discuss it when we get back, or head back. The next battle is an opportunity for you to show your loyalty. The ball is in your court now. Understood. Whether it was not letting her go back with Cornelia or the conversation with Kitako, I was actually trying to win so she had a chance. Desertion is the most serious crime in any military organization. If one doesn't want to be sentenced to death, there's only one way to let the higher-ups know that they are more valuable alive than dead. I'm going to attack point three and deal with the bearer along the way. If you have any method that works, use it. Understand. I can try to turn off the flock's control conditions to shut them down. And the planetary, monetary, like the planetary mo memory algorithm core was blown up, so I can't guarantee the chance of success. That's spherical computer. Huh. Understood. Do your best. Also, Commander, just be careful with the bearer. His body is a special mecha and his combat power. It's roughly equal to 10 of Rose's main battle models. Really? If only the XR87 could be used. I have a battle plan with 51.464% feasible. That is only 4%. That is 51.464% feasible, but I'll need several tactical terminal terminals for simulation. As long as it works, it's not a problem. Are you really sure? I'll do my best. For Cornelia and your trust. Me. For Cornelia and your trust. Okay. So it's partially for me. Mostly for her, but, mo but kind of for me. I appreciate that. Proceed. Okay. Yeah, I've been talking to her. Shut up. Alright, let's go. Are they coming with me? Possibly. Hmm. Crystal is trooper. Big monster. Okay, good thing you showed up. He's down. More. Mm. Back off. At least one of those extra girls came with me. Another? Stop your advances immediately. What? Urgent information. What does that mean? Shield broken. Down. Thanks for the help. Could you repeat that? Liar. I'm very sorry, but it's true. To destroy Solomon directly, the honest crystals will become powdered, drift away in the wind, and pollute a larger area. Explain to me why your research didn't discover this earlier. 
Don't blame us for everything. Has anyone smashed that big crystal before? Stop fighting. Henry, we fought desperately, and this is the result. Damn. Kiriko, what do the higher-ups want us to do? All battlefield processor squads are going to be separately advanced to the main the cross sea bridge. Set up a position. Put the reactor cannon and weapon designed to destroy Solomon to arrive and then attack. That thing is it ready for use? What kind of weapon is that? Zion Bite. Shelzen's Fan Club. A weapon that uses Zionists to eliminate something. It, if it goes well, it can indeed wipe Solomon off the map. But, to start this thing, the energy storage cooling device needs to be properly assembled. Or even the tiniest but careless boom will explode. Can the research uh, center get us some more reliable weapons? How long has it been since the outbreak? Our research has been quite fruitful already. Manage your expectations. Well, that's why we'll need to set up a position again. Everyone move. Big boom. Hope never left is called. This is what this episode's called. Control permissions overridden. 35% of targets have stopped moving. Come on, cuties. <laughs> I won't show any mercy to anyone who gets in my way. I'll take you all down. With Sushi's help, the fight sure got a lot easier. For this kind of result, it should be okay. Huh? I'm a sister, she's in. Are you influenced by someone? Irene, what's wrong? Why are you shaking? No, I'm fine, manager. It will look fine. I'll call Granier. Granier. Granier and over to the Havelock. I cannot pronounce that. I just need to rest. What happened? Sorry, actually. I feel sad about after hearing about the, the crystal powder will drift away. Crystal, crystal powder. I want to protect you all. Protect everyone, but why? And you maybe the bear is right. Smith, it's the only way that can protect everyone from violence, isn't it? Hey, what are you thinking? Do you want to turn into a tin can? Sorry, I know this is wrong, but I, I can't believe that what I'm doing is correct. Marine's hands will stop shaking. Things like these can't possibly shoot well. Come on. Okay, at least we didn't do anything unjust, right? That's just a mistake brought about by insufficient intelligence. I know, I know, but... Manager, I firmly hold Irene's hand and look straight into her eyes. Irene, listen. Listen, Irene. We're the vanguard of mankind. It's our duty to step into the unknown first. We at least must move forward without hesitation, even if we make... maybe. Even if we may make mistakes, or the world will be finished. Even if what we did was wrong, at least we could tell others this won't work. Don't do what we did. Even if it's wrong, it's still valuable, understand? Every hand seems to gradually stabilize. Why are you always so optimistic about that? <laughs> Can't be helped. I'm the manager. I'm the manager! Well, I suppose that as long as you're with me, it should be okay even for someone like me to fight. So the girl, show up. Uh, sure up. Okay. Alright. Yeah, now let's go shoot things. Wait a minute. Oh. Behind me. Oh. Got the shield. Hurry. Come on, we're down. Got it. Oh, wait. They're innocent. Oh, behind us. Leave those girls alone. Oh, wait. Big boy. Mm. Whoop. I thought he was done.
Okay, now he's done. But here come more. Oh, and another one with a bigger shield. That's great. But he should be the final uh, enemy. Yeah, he's paralyzing us. Got him. It's over. One more and we should level up. Kiriko, how long will it take for the reactor cannon to arrive? Clean up this large swarm of mutant cockroaches. Very sorry, miss, but the arrival of the reactor, reactor cannon cannot be confirmed yet. The enemy ambushed the convoy. Squad 13 and the Allied Army's rapid, force, uh, rapid response forces rushed to support them. An ambush? Is our enemy intelligent enough to, to do that? Judging from the images we received, it was just a large number of low-order alphas. But it's strange. Their actions are very structured. Completely different from before, as if somebody's commanding them. How is it possible? Could it be? Coco's face is one of uh, concern, as if she's realized a big problem. Can go pass me through the frontline HQ of the Allied Army. I have something to ask them. I miss. We've been trying to synchronize the Allied Army's frontline battle status, but their systems haven't responded. They aren't thinking of pulling any tricks, are they? At present, there's no sufficient strategic, strategic evidence of that. It's use orders that Squad 8 will break through the Cross Seas Bridge as a vanguard establish, and establish a transportation support position on the other side. In other words, since you don't have anything else to do, take one step further. I'm so resentful, manager. It's actually because the flock has assembled on the bridge, according to the drones. For ground troops, this bridge is the gateway to the core zone. Or port 3, or if, it's, if it's occupied or blown up, they'll be, will be in big trouble. So we must secure the bridge. Manager, if you find it difficult, shall I call on the Allied troops to care of it? No, I'll be the one to beat that damn beggar to be uh, death in person. It's the bearer? Wait, it's the bearer. Task them to make the arrangements. Usha, Irene, come here. Here's your task. Okay, we'll do this one. That'll be it for story mode for now. <laughs> the rose really is a dumpster. You can take traitors in. How would you scare to show his face talking to him? Don't make me laugh. So she told me that the bear's body is a special mecha. It seems that this is him. You mean this mecha is him? What? So my large group of type 3 small type 2 mechas is a huge steel spider. It's four feet or waving triumphantly. <laughs> yeah, too much a blind idiot. You'll never understand how many possibilities evolution holds. Now I can see everything. Even your heart beats as clear as day. This is the power of technology. I don't think changing from a human to a spider can be called evolution. <laughs> <laughs> don't understand one bit. This is... Sorry, I'm not interested in listening to your speech. Villains all have their own ideals. Do you think this is the plot of a game? <laughs> you stupid humans. Hello, Husha? Roger. Moving into offensive position. I knew you were just... You were here just to draw us in and pull the same trick again. Unfortunately, the bomb will appear has been removed. What? Sorry, it's just too old-fashioned. Humans grow from past experience. Remember that. All species, all members, all species, all members of Squad 8. Attack, give it all you've got. She still hasn't figured out who the commander is, has she? Time for a big fight. Wave zero. Wave two? Barra has started to retreat. Oh, so he bailed. I thought we might actually get to fight him now, but... Guess not, because he ran away. Okay. 
Last wave, where is it? There. Trying to overwhelm us. Oh. I still think they look like a, a bunch of Pokemon. Is that it? I think so. Level 15. You should be able to hit this position. Bastards. Are oh, the battlefield processes is powerful? My troops could, wouldn't get all destroyed here, would they? Man, don't be so impatient. See, I told you. I told you we'd see him again. Everything's going well, right? Finally, you decided to show up. You have the gall to talk to me like that. I went to the Allied Army to you for a while and got a, in contact a bit late. There's no need to be mad about it. Has your damned army from the overworld or other world arrived? Like we agreed, I'm not. I'm just going to help guard it before your troops arrive. I didn't send you a batch of crystals to hear that. Anyway, I can't hold off Rose's attack any longer. I'm pulling out. Did you speak with her about that? Don't threaten me with that woman. I promised to help you, yes. But I've lost most of my troops. The valuable asset that I managed to recruit also got abducted. What else do you want me to do? Fine, fine, follow the plan. I want to activate the Arkham. You just need to hold out a bit longer. Rest assured, we will never treat brave warriors poorly. What you want will be available after our army arrives. You better keep your word. These other world guys seem unreliable. Anyway, I can't lose all my troops here. I better withdraw right now. Yeah. We beat you real bad. But that's going to be it for now. In terms of... Doing the story mode. <laughs>